हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल एंड फॉर टुडेज वीडियो वी विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट माय फेवरेट आर एम ये दिस इज़ माय फर्स्ट एंड स्टिल द फेवरेट आर एम आई हैव सीन लाइक द रीज़न बाय आई थिंक दिस इज़ द बेस्ट आर एम आई हैव वॉच टी लेट आई वॉच अ गुड नंबर ऑफ आर एम्स बट द रीज़न दिस इज़ द बेस्ट इज़ बिकॉज ऑफ द मेन कैरेक्टर जोरो एंड basically what is the like the harem plot the harem plot is basically like uh, a main guy who is like dense as fuck who doesn't like uh, know that many girls loves him and stuff and all but this motherfucker like this guy <laughs> he is like such a giga child first let me like first he comes in when i was like the interesting story about oresuki I watched this for I I was very new when I watched it. This is like really one of my beginner anime so I have a lot of nostalgia but I still think this is one of the best anime I have watched in terms of harem of course. In terms of harem this is like a 100 out of 10 like how good it is. So how I found it is like it's very interesting. I was just like wandering around Instagram and I found this I watched a serious uh, scene from this where like the main girl and the main girl there's no main girl in harem we know that right so the girl and the boy is like having a serious conversation and i'm like damn this looks cool this looks good as harem and not harem i mean this looks good as romance this will like this looks like this will deal a lot of issues about romance and then i like downloaded it i asked for a suggestion from one of my friends he is such a he is a really great guy He told me it's really good watch it he didn't tell me that it's harem or anything and when i was it i opened it i was like wait did i download the right thing but then i was also like wait isn't this way too much enjoying so that's what happened so besides that i think the best thing about this was how joro is like this uh, this guy he is totally aware of he is an anime character <laughs> like the anime has a lot of fo- fourth wall break moment so he is like totally aware he is a harem protagonist or he is a side character he comes in and is like i am joro i am the main protagonist of this guy in every shoujo and stuff they get introduced like that but it gets even funnier when he is like uh, there was a stuff when the the main focus girl was talking to him about something and joro like mat 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 chotto matte chotto matte just stop we are just in the episode 4 or something he said something like that you don't have to go this further in the story the people are not ready for this much of twist and i was like this guy is such a giga chad like who is this guy man i love this guy and the beginning starts like the he has a he has a senpai this is a pretty basic harem setting right he has a main girl the main girl story i won't say he is a childhood friend pretty basic he has a senpai pretty basic and a sundare pretty basic right but when does it get funny because mainly the main character of harems don't realize that they, this is going to be this is going to be something else in future and this guy is like shut up bitch you use me and the the voice acting is so great for oresuki The best thing about Oresuki is the voice acting I will say. The voice acting is so great in this anime. The Joro just goes like sometimes he will go like oh daijawo. And it's even greater. I can't like imitate him obviously, but it's so great and he's like sometimes the there was a moment like I love how how powered this guy is. The, there was a moment when his childhood friend was pressing a boobs to him. and he's like ah bitch 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 he's like literally the guy is moaning and drooling and i'm like damn is this and since this was my first harem so i don't know anything how harem protagonist are supposed or i didn't even knew that this was a harem i was just watching it and i was enjoying the fuck out of it and i have tried to rewatch it it's still one of the best harem in my opinion it's still the best not one of the best this is still the best harem like this is the harem we need the fourth wall breaks the childhood friend and the thing beside the comedy there are some really good serious scenes 
and they left a big impression on me there was a school festival and the school festival was fucking amazing and the guy has a rival so the anime the anime originally isn't like the anime has an uh, anime original ending it's adapted from a light novel but besides the original ending the original ending is fucking good and we might know it's not like it ended i can't say that it was a proper ending in the ova we have 12 episode of uh, season 1 and an ova and the ova takes it even step further the ending for ova is like one of the best harem harem ending like the way <laughs> i would tell this just just pause the show like how just remembering how much i love this how funny this this show was oh yeah yeah and there was, there's another girl who is like the ideal girl from the for the protagonist i forgot the harem's ideal girl so there are five girls sundere childhood friend main girl ideal girl the senpai and the senpai sometimes whenever she gets like uh, uh, she is like uh, nervous she turns into a samurai and those seen are so fucking funny like i love it and the guy is just a giga chad he just if uh, and when there was a fan service episode the guy was like ah this is the fan service episode i need and the guy is literally like me like the the guy will be like sometimes the watching experience he's like you will feel like is this guy in anime or is this guy sitting with me and commenting on the anime you will be like that it's like uh, saying in tama will be like a big thing but i think the fourth wall break is so well timed and great and the comedy is everything and as harem there should be some fan service the fan service isn't fucking great oh my god i didn't notice that i put boobs in that edit so the fan service is fucking great if you don't know so yeah i mean this like uh, if the i think many people has liked this the like i don't see many people hating on this show even this this is a harem like whoever has watched this they don't think it's like a masterpiece or anything but they still think it's one of the best show best harem they has to be offered so yeah this is one of the best in my opinion and i don't know how to explain more about it and if you want some spoilers like no i shouldn't spoil so this will be like much this was just like how much i love the show and all but if you just want to watch it This is an amazing show. Fan service 10 out of 10, comedy 10 out of 10, fourth wall break 10 out of 10, main character Giga Chad all girls. Wait. There's another girl junior. This this is the thing. I should have done my research before. But the thing that I can remember about every character here is a big thing because I generally forget about most of the character. If you tell me about some of the any harem like Masamune Kunno Revenge or Nishe Koi I don't remember how many girls were there or what were their special traits or anything. I just forgot about those two shows. Dude. I know I shouldn't compare but I think those two were really shit. Those two were really boring. So yeah, Oresuki has lot to offer, a lot of girls, a lot of fan service, a lot of comedy, a lot of broken English. And I don't know how is the dub or if there is even a dub, but the sub is fucking great guys. The voice acting is oh, brilliant. So I suggest watching it in sub. You can watch it in dub if there's one. You can give it a shot if you don't like it. Come back into this. You don't get the oh deja vu in the dub, right? The deja vu. And the funniest thing about uh, this is the Joro's main character is Deku from My Hero Academia. And if you don't know My Hero Academia, it's so oh, it's fine. But I believe everyone who is watching is 90% of the people know of it. So yeah I think that will be it for the Oresugi review It's a must watch anime fucking masterpiece of an harem I don't know what more to say So yeah if you like the video smash the like button and comment what anime you want me to review or if you have any topic you want me to discuss like I've been thinking about I should talk about uh, anime openings or like some anime plots and how they affect in anime So if you want me to do that stuff I will give this a shot I I really want to do that but if no one is interested in that I won't do it 
so yeah that's it for the video comment about what you think or what you want me to do next and subscribe to the channel obviously take care and i will see you in the next one goodbye